We're going to go from sunshine to storms and I want to start off our forecast with an alert day. Strong storms are going to return Wednesday and the WTOL 11 weather team wants to keep you in the loop on how this weather may affect you. Temperatures are going to be in the 70s. Yeah, you read that right. It is going to be a balmy spring day and when it gets that warm this time of year that can actually fuel rising warm air in the atmosphere. Our storm timeline is going to be 2 to 8 p.m. during that afternoon and early evening time. Make sure you're checking radar on the WTOL 11 weather app strong to borderline severe thunderstorms will be possible and even when it's not storming it's going to be incredibly windy with high temperatures up in the 70s let's break down the timeline you're going to wake up to a rainy morning it's going to be very breezy and mild now that morning round of rain is not expected to be severe you'll want the umbrella though as you're headed into work in the afternoon storms developing some of which could be strong to severe and 2 to 8 p.m is the window of time that we could see a couple severe thunderstorms with strong straight line winds, 40 to 60 mile per hour wind gusts and heavy rainfall will be the biggest impacts. And as we saw this weekend, April starting off with an active and unsettled weather pattern. Stay on high alert with this system. Here's a look at the timing. That morning round of rain is going to roll in and it's not going to be strong or severe, but it will still be wet and windy. In fact, when you wake up Wednesday morning, it is already going to be in the 60s. We'll surge to the 70s ahead of this cold front. And whenever you get the warm and moist and cold air that butt heads this time of year, that is a recipe for stormy, windy and unsettled weather. This cold front's going to sweep in from west to east and bring us that storm threat. Right now it is beautiful outside 48 degrees and I want to take a better look at the sky because we have some beautiful fair weather cumulus clouds with blue in the sky and look at this view of downtown Toledo as well. The Maumee River looking gorgeous and you see some of those fair weather clouds, but also a good amount of blue in the sky. These clouds are just a nice decoration. If we're being honest, it looks beautiful up in the sky. And even though the wind is kicked up a little bit, we're seeing that south southeasterly breeze. It still feels nice if you have that light jacket this evening. Temperature wise close to 50 across much of the area, including Henry and Fulton counties, but it is a little cooler along the Lake Erie shoreline out towards Port Clinton. It's only 43 degrees Sandusky 38 and out on the Lake Erie Islands, a current temperature of 38 degrees. The first Further south and west you go, generally the balmier it is. Tonight is our first 8 o'clock p.m. sunset of the year, and by the end of April, we are going to be at 8.30, so you've got plenty of time to enjoy this sunshine if you've been cooped up today. As we start off the work week, it's going to be an April shower type weather pattern. We do have a slight chance for late day showers on Monday. It's not going to be a washout by any means. Tuesday, there's another light shower chance, and it's going to be one of those days where the infamous lake breeze returns. It'll be in the 50s in the Toledo Metro, but cooler along the Lake Erie shoreline. There it is, bright and red, that Wednesday alert day as thunderstorms return. We just want to give you advance notice that, hey, this could be a day that we see unsettled weather. By Thursday, the calm after the storm as bright sunshine returns. I do want to time out some of those early week rain showers. When you wake up tomorrow morning, it is just going to be, well, dry and partly sunny, similar to to what we're experiencing right now. That being said, by Monday evening, there is the chance that we get a round of rainfall that moves in. Yes, a few cracks of thunder are possible, but Monday is not going to be a severe weather type day. Neither is Tuesday. As this rolls in from the west, we are going to see additional on and off showers possible during the day Tuesday, but nothing really of consequence until Wednesday when we see that stormy weather move on through. There it is, alert day, shaded in red, a 70% chance for thunder and soaking downpours behind that system. System. Nice and quiet weather returns into next weekend. Temperatures nearing the 60 degree mark. It is going to be bright and beautiful with some nice spring weather later on in the week. By Sunday, we will have our next chance for some scattered rain showers. And towards the end of the 10 day forecast, even though April has started off with an active weather pattern, we are going to turn brighter, cooler, and more beautiful towards the end of the 10 day forecast.